we've got to talk about your famous speech in 2012. Uh, for those who haven't seen Julia's speech on misogyny and the problems women face in public life, you've got to watch it. It is fantastic. I suppose two questions. Do you think things have changed either for the better or for the worse for women in public life? And if you face that choice again now, would you enter public life? for the first time? Well, let me take the second question first, and the answer is yes, absolutely, 100% okay. in a heartbeat. Um, and I'm very strident about that because I do want us to understand and be changing uh, the gender inequalities that still face women in politics and in other publicly exposed mm -hmm. professions. But I'm always conscious in doing that and shining a light on the gendered barriers that we may be putting women off choosing this career yeah. path. Yeah. And I never want to put anybody off because uh, for all of the still gendered bits and for all of the stresses and strains of politics, the opportunity to put your values into action, to change your community, your nation, your world, there is no better position on earth to do that than mm -hmm. from politics. I'm a very big defender um, and I know people like to go, oh, you know, they're all the same. It doesn't matter. Who cares? It really matters and it really makes a difference. Who is there? The capability of the people. And if you've got the enthusiasm for it, absolutely go for okay. it. Is it getting better? Uh, yes, I think it's certainly got better in this sense that um, why, when I was Prime Minister, the sort of fashionable analysis was nothing that was happening to me was about gender. It was, I was just being treated like every other Prime Minister. You know, from this perch now in 2023, no one would say that. Yeah.